Solar Lithium Battery Bank. Best budget battery bank. Bang for the buck. Guys, I'm just bringing something rare, something weird, or something I've never done on my channel. And this idea popped to me, which I want to discuss with you. I want to show you how you can go on a budget if your loan funds, you don't have the money, but you want to leave like the big guys or the Joneses or whatever, but you are skin on cash. And um, the best way you can do that, even though you have money to buy the Nissan Leaf batteries, which are not cheap, but it's, it's a decent price. But guys, and you don't have all the bells and whistles to go with that. And all you need to do, or all you have to do at that point, because everything on the Nissan Leaf is kind of expensive. So, this is what you do. You get yourself rods, uh, threaded rods, instead of um, getting the ones that came with the battery, which are very expensive. That's uh, one tip. These are all the tips you can do. A threaded rod you can buy a 10 foot for uh, about eight dollars or something five six seven dollars for one of them and uh, you can buy yourself um, nuts okay if it doesn't come with a bolt you can go and get some bolt at the store Okay, I think it's uh, a five millimeter, something like that. And if you'd have spacers, that would be another video I'm going to be making. You can create spacers for yourself. And now let's come to the other fun part, which is the bus part. Haha, -ha. look at this. You're on a budget. You are on a budget. You don't want to spend money and you don't probably have it. And there's no way you can get it. And because of that, that doesn't stop you not to run your lithium batteries. And you could come up with the thing. What I do, uh, I did here, um, these are different bus bars. You can see the silver, so it comes in the car. And these ones, you can get them at the store or you can order them. And this is just a form of um, showing you what, how to improvise other stuff. That's another thing, improvise. And what I did here, I went and got a, a Romax cable just to show other people that I think they cannot do that. It costs money and whatever. And uh, what about the bus bars? And what about the spacers? And what about threaded rods? And I've shown you that side. And now you get the bus bars. You can do it this way. I call it the rich man way or this is the original or the standard for whatever. It comes with more decent and professional. And... Um, now you can get a Romax cable, which um, this one is a 12 gauge Romax. So I use, I can use the, the art ground cable on it, or you can use the neutral, you can use the, the hot wire. So it's just a matter of peeling the skin and taking it out, or maybe you can leave the skin. So that's why I end up doing a, a different things here for people who wants to do that. So you can use just a copper uh, like a ground wire cable, maybe um, number uh, 10, or you can use uh, um, number 12 or 14, whatever. And you can see what I did here. I just loop it um, around the, 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 the bolt and screw it in. Just make a loop, okay? Just a loop. And um, you can see a clear presentation right here what I did and squeeze it all the way and get all your size or you can do this other way which you can leave the uh, insulation insulator there so you can have anything probably touching or whatever worry about something it's kind of a little bit decent this way so that's why I took different steps here this is one step right here leave the the uh, insula insulation there and or you can use this as a positive and you can use the black one as the, the negative and you can able to incorporate that and get your um it's a fairly decent cable it's really tough you can just there's no way you can just arc that one and burnt it right away it, it's tough but when you look at the, the the diameter of this uh um 
Nissan Leaf um, bus bar, they're not that thick compared to the, to that wire. That wire is huge and thick, and it takes a lot of amps, you know, passing about 30, uh, 40, 30 amp or 40 amps into this, like nobody's business. So this is the way you can do it, the rich man way, the poor man's way, like other people normally say. But if it's, I call it on budget, the best battery, lithium battery on budget construction, this is what it is. So I have uh, 3.5 kilowatts here. So what I did, I got all parallel, parallel four of these ones, which is a, a 5, 10, 15, 20. It's a 2,000 watt here, and here's a 1,500 watt here, three of them. Because I don't have the fourth battery here to do the demonstration, and I don't want to take all the batteries from the other bank, so... I just decided to do it this way. So you can do this. This is a 12 volt configuration right here. You seen, and you have all the center tap. So because it's a four batteries in these cells, inside these cells, they are series, series, and parallel. So you have four batteries there. That gives you a total of uh, um, um, 7.6 nominal voltage, and you can charge all the way to 8.3 um volt pencil so if you calculate here is uh let's do um 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 seven of these guys will give you a 48 volt okay about approximately 57 58 volt here right now if i did that in series so positive would that be a negative here positive negative positive so um that will give you for 48 volts configuration right here it depends. That's a 14S. You can do a 16S. Mostly my configurations are 16S on my 48 volt. So this is how it is. And on a budget, you can do this way. I decided to show you guys because um, I don't just want to keep showing you the fancy. Like I told you guys, my channel um, is all about uh, teaching people things and how you can do it in an old-fashioned way or you can do it on a budget or you can do it um, just because you don't have the materials present at the moment. So because of that, it doesn't mean you can have to stop your project or whatever you're doing from not finishing it or waiting for the right wires or right equipment to show up. Anyway, so this is what it is. They're already compressed. So I'm going to set these batteries in vertical so you can see exactly um, how everything looks like. I hope you, you can see what I did here. And if you think this one is kind of helpful, give it a like and, uh, um, share the video with the rest of the, uh, the community on Facebook, um, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, you know, tell them that JW Solar USA sent you. So I decided to come up with this idea. I know I was just thinking about it. I don't know if, um, some someone already done that on YouTube or whatever. I don't know. I, did, I never checked because I don't know how to call it or what to look for. You see, because you have to know, even you're doing a research, you have to know what you're looking for. I don't know how am I going to name this. So um, I came up with my name. So whatever, um, if it's going to help someone or someone's going to find it on YouTube or maybe think um, it's going to be hard to find and pass it on so that other people can able to see this is for um, on budget or under budget or, you know, um, just the poor man's way, the rich man's way or the fancy way, the ugly way. But that works, you know, sometimes not everything that's pretty works, but, you know, ugly things can work, too. But uh, I just decided to do this construction here and to show you guys this is with the insulator and uh, this one without the insulator, I would have used the. Um, the black wire, which um, would have been um, like a negative, positive, and this uh, um, gold or copper would have been the center tap. So mostly I normally use these guys here, the copper ones for positive, and this uh, silver, this is a, 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 a tin plated, it's a copper uh, plated. 
tin plated whatever um is spray but if you see at it if you look at it you see the copper on it so guys this is what i decided to do just sitting here trying to think and say hey no i have to make videos all the time about doing things a decent way or whatever it is but um let me show some kind of weird thing which probably a lot of people already done that um i've done another one with the Grimmeister dave a few days a uh, few last week with um um a copper pipe so we bought a copper pipe because we ran out of boss bar. That's how this thing started. So I was like, you know what? We can go then get go get some copper uh, uh, pipe at the store, uh, one inch. Then it just smashed that and drilled the holes. Make sure they're all um, parallel and they're all um, uh, in the correct direction. And that's what he did. And we made a boss bar until... Yeah, it end up having some bus bars if you want to change them. But I think it's kind of happy with that. When you look at it, we measure the thickness of the original bus bar plus the one that he just created. We put together the copper pipe. And trust me, guys, that was really thick. So you can pass all kind of currents like like this one. You can just want to make one bus bar. Or if you want to do a seven of these in parallel, then you can put those. You have... Um, four of these for um for um a 24 volt that's cool you have to have eight of these if you put them in sevens so it's a 66 times seven that's a lot of amps here so what i did now this is just one string and this is one string so i have to use one of these um interconnect or uh, jumpers i can use a jumper like this and touch it right here okay it's not gonna arc so now it gives you this battery is already serious by doing so okay by putting this jumper here you create the a circuit which is the series I can put this one in between here if I put a probe on one of the end parts here the end of this guy I'm drawing from here and here I'm charging on this post so by putting this one there you already created a 12 volt Right now they're sitting at seven, seven point six volts or whatever eight volts. It depends how they are, how, if the batteries are charged that way. So right now it's a seven point six under seven, seven point six. So seven point six here, but the amperage is different. This one has more amps, sixty six times four, this sixty six times three here. So by putting this one here, that gives you the the twelve volt configuration. All right. Thanks for watching. Just kill another 13 minutes again. I hope it what it makes it um it's worth uh, worth watching and that's the word and I hope you like um what I created here. And if you've seen that before, okay, that's good for you. If you haven't seen that, well, something for you to think about. All right? You can do anything, you can make anything possible. Just you have to, you know, there are a lot of people with different ideas and things that we tend to neglect that works i'm not saying it's not dangerous it is but i can touch it right now no nothing but if i put my skin you know my um skin i'm always covered like a shirt or whatever and i can feel the bite you know all right take care guys love you guys all subscribe and share bye from minnesota jw solar